What sign is on? 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. Hey everybody, it's been a long summer, we did a lot of ice cream truck live, and now we're at Veo Canyon, Veo Pool in Veo, Utah, ready to party. Can't wait to go claw out fishing. Ah! <laughs> they even have rock climbing here. But lay on. While we're waiting for the rest of the group to show up, it's time to put on our vacation tattoos. I got this cute little guy. We'll see what these other guys got here in just a minute. I got a unicorn. I got a heart. Every time I get a skeleton, I don't know why. They've got this awesome pool. Let's go swim in it. <laughs> so the way they fill this pool is really cool. They fill the pool with the natural spring water. It's the same water that we're crawdad fishing in, but it's nice and clean and really refreshing. And each night they drain the pool so you get a fresh set of water in the morning. Yum, and Leiden, what'd you get? Fruit beer, mug. So they get these cups for $5 each, and then they get free drinks for the entire trip. How much soda are you guys gonna drink? All of it! All of it. Uh, we don't drink soda at home usually, so this is gonna be crazy soda weekend. Go, 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 like it. Diet Pepsi puts him down. Dr. Pepper fixes him up. That is why we drink stuff up. They've got 30 climbing routes. This one is rated a 5.7. It's perfect for me, beginner level. And you can see me climbing in this video. <laughs> Whoa, all the way up there, Nani? Yep, I did it. Well, you kind of hoisted me up there, but yeah. Watch me climb fly soup. Watch me do my first lead climb on Superfly. Seems nice. He just foams at the mouth. Yeah. <laughs> Aww. Poor little guy. Just surviving on crawdads and leftover soda. Time to go cloud and fishing. What you catching them with, Link? A rod, a string, and a clip. What's the trick to catching a good crowd out? Be patient. Just like fishing. So what nope. kind of bait should you use? Um ham. Or um a turkey. What about hot dogs? Uh no. So Lincoln's using a this a little clip on some fishing line up to a pole. And that's it. And then are they, where do you find them mostly, Lincoln? C, C, Z, quad out crazy zone, right here. And are they in the, like under rocks, or where do you, where do you look for them? Um, just keep my eyes peeled, they're not under rocks, so. All right, Lydon, show us what you got. It's a crawdad. Whoa! She helped, she helped me catch it. 
Oh my goodness, goodness. What, what kind of bait were you using when you caught him? Uh, we were right, using pick up the rock, scared where in the bucket. Climbed, oh, you didn't use any bait at all? We were trying to use this, but it didn't work. You just scooped him? Basically. So he was just slow enough for you to catch. Do you dare to touch him? Yeah. Oh, he's a jumper. <laughs> can I touch him? Can I touch him? No, but. Yeah, try to touch him, Lincoln. Will he bite you? No. He'll pinch, but he it's a, it doesn't hurt. Touch did he him. Did he pinch you? No. Touch him. <laughs> this is weird. What do you think, Link? Oh. What do you think? Did he bite you? No, he didn't bite me. He, he, and he pinches, he does not bite. Lincoln lost his sandal because they were playing a game where they put the sandal in way up the river and then they follow it all the way down the river and catch it at some other point. But they kind of forgot to follow it, so we're on the hunt. Link, have you seen it yet? I think right here. I'll get it. Oh, it's it, all right. That's the CC, the Crawdad Crazy Zone. Crawdad Crazy Zone? There's crawdads all over the place. Who's gonna get it? You. What, you think I'm gonna get it? Okay. You're the one with actual shoes on. I guess I have to go get it because it's the CC, the Crawdad Crazy Zone. No, I call this the CCZ. Success! Success. Here you go, dude. What do you have to say to the people at home? Um. Why and where and what and how? When you come to Veo, Utah, you have to stop. Whoa, just threw my keys. You have to stop at world famous Veo Pies because they have world famous pies. In fact, yesterday I saw BYU basketball coach Dave Rose here picking up a pie, so I think he knows what's up. Today we're gonna come in and get another little treat. Oh, what are you guys gonna get? What are you guys gonna get? Can I have like a whole pie? No. <laughs> We had the pies yesterday, so today we just went with the danishes. The pies are delicious, but the danishes, that's where I think it's at. Are. Aren't these fun? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> also, follow Lane Called on YouTube. <laughs> Keeping it tidy? Keeping it tidy. You know, Anon doesn't like a dirty tent. I'm surprised you didn't bring the vacuum, actually. I should have. But I did I make know. our beds every day. You did make our beds every day. Yeah, thank you for doing all of that. It's You're okay. great. Great. Camp post? Camp post. Tent, yep. tent post? You got it. Okay. That's how it's done. That's how you take down a tent. The most easy tent to put up and take down. You can get it at Sam's Club at the link below. <laughs> Ding! <laughs> <laughs> well, here I sit on the world's largest rocking chair in Beaver, Utah. Hope you enjoyed this video of Veo, Utah. And the next time you're heading out of town, looking for a new place to try out, head to Veo. Get a pie. See you later. <laughs> Body goals. Body goals. Body goals. Come back soon. What's the next step? <laughs> uh, this is how to tear down a camp. When you tear it down, you just take everything down and put it in the back of your car. Go home. I don't know. <laughs> no, not... it's important. There's there's much more important steps to this. This is like Tetris because we are luxury campers. We're luxury campers. I think so.
Don't you think so? We camp in luxury. We yeah. do, so we bring a lot of crap with us. Like, yeah. yeah, we all have our own air mattress. We all have our own air we mattress, have these, our own pillows. These enormous camp chairs instead of the little compactable ones. But these were the ones that everyone sat in all the time. I know. Everyone was touting theirs, how awesome their camp chairs were. Then they sat in ours. Yep. We got a rice cooker. We brought a crock pot. Yeah. So now Off the grid camping. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. We're deluxe campers. <laughs>